Well, instead of screaming happy Friday like we normally do on 517 Fridays, we're a little bit more zen today because we're at Live Well with yes. Sarah Pierce from 517 Living. How are you? It's been so long since I've seen you. I know. Happy <laughs> Friday. Yeah, yes. it feels so peaceful in here, like essential oils and there's calming nature sounds. Mm -hmm. I love just stepping in here just for a reset. And on Sunday this weekend at Live Well, the Healing Community, from 1.30 to 3, there's a mindful men's group here, oh. which you don't see on the calendar or in general, you mm -hmm. don't see a whole lot of men's groups. So this is a really cool one that I really encourage people to check out. It's guided by hypnotherapist Joel Hansen. And this monthly men's group is a safe space to slow down. It gives men an opportunity to remove emotional blocks, tools to help deal with the unexpected, connect at a deeper level, and of course, have fun. Step into your authentic self to grow your confidence and power and to be enough. Become the man you've always wanted to be mm -hmm. with a community of men growing forward alongside you. So if you're a man who is just kind of feeling disconnected, mm -hmm. you want to maybe meet some like-minded friends and grow and just kind of tap into your potential, this is a group that you want to check out. It's donation-based. Everyone's welcome. That's so great. And you can just build community from there. And yep. what a great spot where you can definitely feel supported right here at Live Well. And I know yeah. also this weekend, another way to build community is kind of exploring a little bit of history with antiques and shopping. Yeah, this one is perfect for the holiday season. It's the Centennial Farms Fall Antique Market Ooh. at Centennial Farms in DeWitt. And it's Saturday and Sunday from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Take a step back in time at this market, which features antiques and vintage items in the barn, chicken coop, granary, <laughs> under the pavilion, and on the lawn. Enjoy strolling the grounds and a cookie and coffee while you're shopping and mingling. So it's a great opportunity to find some unique holiday mm -hmm. items, maybe some gifts, and maybe meet some new friends. Yeah, oh, I love that. And you know, you mentioned holidays, which, you know, we're thinking big holidays, like the ones that happen at the end of the year. But before mm -hmm. that is uh, Halloween, and we can't forget about Halloween and there's so much fun. Halloween's kind of, not necessarily spooky, but some fun yeah. at the zoo. <laughs> this one's a cute spooky. Yes, it's a cute like, spooky. It's not gonna give you nightmares. Right. You can bring the toddlers. <laughs> it's a boo at the zoo at Potter Park Zoo, the beloved zoo of our community on Saturday and Sunday from 12 to 5 p.m. Prepare for an enchanting event, bursting with colors, costumes, and a whole lot of candy. Gather your family and friends, slip into your most bewitching Halloween attire, <laughs> and head out for a delightful stroll featuring an inflatable zone, glow light room, hay ride, cider and donuts, hay bale maze, candy stations, costume parade, and all other kinds of entertainment. Oh, wow. This is gonna be a very family friendly yeah. event, and it's perfect to kick off the Halloween season. Yes, oh, I'm so excited. I gotta think of my costume. <laughs> Alrighty, something has to be like zoo themed. You know, we gotta be yeah, match the animal. Right, right. <laughs> All right, and those are just some of the many events that we can check out this weekend. Of course, we can find that full list at 517living.com. Yes, there's so many Halloween events. I actually partnered up with Lansing Family Fun this year to try to get every Ooh. single Halloween event that's family friendly on the calendar. So if you're looking for something to do, this is the place to go. And then of course we have the Facebook group called 517 Living Community, close to 60,000 people in that group. And it's a great place to connect about local goodness. Mm -hmm. Yeah, community is definitely the theme here on this Friday. Well, thank you so much for letting thank us you. stop by and we'll do a nice peaceful happy, happy Friday. Friday.